two seed of the tournament. Yeah, that's about expected to see you at the winners finals. I'm sure we'll see it again in grands, quite honestly. Uh, no, not, not to say that that's it's gonna happen, guaranteed. So I'm it, sure losers is full of. If skills. you were a betting man, it's definitely a, a good bet to put yeah, on. To with, uh, but like you said, losers has a lot of killers going on in it right now. But right now, neither one of these players want to be the one that sits in losers early on. They want to solidify their seat in grand finals. Win aside. Now, the different team composition here, that both of these players on the green team have quite a bit of experience against uh, Ling's Peach. But oh, yeah. the, 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 you know, the new factor being the Joker from Phantom, Phantom tends to play a lot more Palatina in singles lately. Like, this is the one that they got to play around to get used to as the match progresses. Gosh, I miss Marth. Same. I'm sure Marth was so sick. I, lo I love Marth. He's not in this game, but one day he'll come back. It's okay, his sister is. Just made every Fire Moon fan so mad. <laughs> the, you, you, I'll, I'll be real. You just made me mad a little bit too. But you know. <laughs> I mean, isn't Marth like her great, 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 great grandfather? It, or something? It's like way down the line. Yeah, I, I always love watching um, Fox. I mean, excuse me, uh, Light use the up B of Firefox to hit hitboxes that have. I um, mean, hit recoveries that have no hitboxes. Yeah, it, it, he's stolen a couple games before from people by doing that. That's a good option. It's so active, you really just can't miss. Yeah, and it has a lot of knockback on it, too. Yeah. Light trying to go for the reverse edge guard, but he's going to get edge guarded himself after going for that back air. Tetragon is going to take it out. That small lead for red team so far. They're both at kill percent. Yeah, you can see the green team just forcing Don, uh, uh, after forcing Don on stage, the red team's primary focus seems to be focusing on Don, but going to close out a stock finally on, on Ling. Downer should take it out, too. There we go. Back to even game. You said canned pizza? What kind of, yeah, kind of heathen I, nonsense I, is I, that? I chose to ignore that. I'm not going to lie. I'm sorry. That hurt That hurt me to read that. And let alone say it. What the hell is canned pizza? Canned bread. Oh, all right. All right. We're, all right, we're, done, we're done with this one. <laughs> <laughs> like a can of sardines on the stage right now. Everybody kind of swinging up close to each other. But Ling deciding to fly away. Get away from that nasty smell. I admire that segue. That's what I do, man. <laughs> Actually, really, it, it's just because I'm, I'm hungry. But I don't want sardines. I want some of that bani that's uh, that's going on over in the corner there. Are you right? Light hungry for the stock. So is Don trying to look for the anti air, but good timing from Ling. Meanwhile, Phantom just being stuck at the ledge. And that, uh, the longer you keep Phantom at the ledge, I know I've said it many times, but the if you can get rid of that stock or time out the arson. But sadly for them, Ling comes in, closes it out, takes off the the lead. You don't really expect the shield damage that Arsene does too. Like he will, uh, yeah. if you don't keep shielding, he will destroy you. It's just that, that the pressure of uh, like it, the, all the actually Fox does it too. The empty hot pressure around you. Good uh, swift uh, pickup from Light right there after being four throw, go closing out the back air. But the anti air coming in with the up smash gonna bring it right back to where they were before. Yeah, back on the uh, Light's super pressure thing is he will sure up in front of you like four times. Mm -hmm. just, you just keep doing it. He doesn't care. Yeah, because if, you 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 if you can't focus enough fear, but Don noticing that Ling made one mishap, trying to go for a follow-up afterwards, closing it out to up smash. Even if he got hit by uh, Joker, that's okay, as long as he gets rid of Ling's stock. Oh, yeah, the smart call with the double B <laughs> neutral B there because that would have been the stock if he decided to go a little bit early. Got the swiftness of down here into that up smash, like, but also the swift conversion from Ling to go close out that stock. Ooh, no pick up on the combo there. Right, we talk about two v ones all day. Now, this is definitely not a good position for Light yeah. right now, being off stage. But oh my god, this comp against Light is just the swiftness just and like that. Not even too worried about a trade right there. Ling's down yep. in a perfect spot. Yeah, that's perfect. Between Ling down at the bottom. Uh, the potential of a drop down from Phantom up top. If he recovered high, he was already putting the back out there up high. They every yeah. single option. That was really good play from both of them. It kind of uh, similar to how we've been complimenting uh, Light and Don's ledge trapping. They did it with the the edge guard. Yeah. So that that was really good close out, and you have to because Light is amazing at two v ones too. That's that, that's why get him where it hurts, where he can't get back. <laughs> that's why I think your team the comp is so good. Uh, Light and or, uh, Ling and Ling and uh, Phantom. It's like they're both individual and singles. They are both so aggressive off stage. They will get, they're so good at edge riding, both of them. Yep. Put them together, and if you're in 2v1, you're never coming back. Yep. Not even light. Those recoveries are always like phenomenal. Yeah. His angles are perfect, his, just, his movement is always so good off stage, but you can't get around that. You can't parry with an up B off stage. Yeah, you, so. you, can't, you can't parry downwards gun. Yep. 
Not much you can do about you can, that. You just suffer. Ah, uh, this would be a best of five. This is winners finals. Yeah, top three best of five doubles. I assume singles would be top eight. If I had to take a, take a stab at uh, it. Ah, that's a pretty good guess. But I mean, are we going by the rule of Intero Bang or no? <laughs> Game number two. <coughs> uh, it's, 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 I it's, believe it's, we're running it right back. Actually, yeah. Intero Bang here. He is. Okay. And maybe. I'm actually getting scared after what I just said. Like, <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> we only have so much time we could be in this building today. That's true. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> but anyways. <laughs> See, I'm so scared at the idea now. I'm getting afraid. But game number two here. Uh, Phantom and Ling Ling doing a great job of uh, kind of s s really putting their foot down on that first game. Because last thing you want to do is be behind. Especially when, Do like, Light are is always turned up when he's playing matches. It's just the way it is. But when Don, when Don starts feeling himself, Mario combos, they, they just suck to have to deal with. They, yeah. they, the, the damage racks up so fast, and Don is so good at closing him out when he needs. There we go. Gets an unintentional reset, but he gets the reset nonetheless. Accidentally hits his teammate, but then uses him as a battering ram. That was the best <laughs> possible Such thing he could have done there. <laughs> no, that was actually really smart. It's just it's so funny to look at. Yeah. He's like, all right, all right, like, I'm going to need you real quick. Hold up. <laughs> You see Light trying to look for uh, Phantom coming in to try and save Ling Ling, but Phantom just holding his ground. Hey, you really got to just uh, compliment all the defense that they have. Up, he's not going to be able to make it back, though. Went a little bit too horizontal, that back air sending him at a great angle. No capitalization from Ling because he decided to wait for the de defensive move afterwards. That was good because he knew that even with that fair, it didn't have enough end lag on him for the go punish it. And yeah. then the movement from Light covering that ledge trap. Going to close it out. Green team holding the lead. All right, Light's off stage here. Not a good spot. He makes it back, actually. Oh, I think he was trying to cape him on maybe a side B if he was trying to recover or an up B. But I can see it. He ended up just caping a fair into his face anyways. All right, Don down to his last stock, Light holding on at 165, and being, you know, how do I put this? Fox being Light. I was going to say Light being Light. That that, that would have, that could mean so many different things. You see that edge guard, That's though. what I was talking God. about earlier, the lingering hitboxes of that Firefox. It's hard to time the, the tech. Yeah, plus it becomes untechable pretty early. Yeah. It's, it's kind of nuts. That has a lot of base knockback. Light still so holding on after all this, like I said, at 165. And he's digging deep. Oh, the shine spike. He's, he's outside now. He's yeah, Arsene, oh, Arsene's still going to make it back. Okay. Oh, Don tried to go save him, but Don's going to somehow make it through the fire and fury of everybody over there and get himself back. Ling looking for the ledge trap, trying to go for a roll read, but Don's going to keep himself alive. Ling tr trying to close it out, but instead of trying to go 2v1 with Light, he's deciding to still box with Ling. There we go. Going to get himself out. There's the coverage from Light. Up smash gonna actually close that. I didn't think I was gonna kill for a second. We're missing the share stock before them. Oh, that a forward smash would have taken it out. Just missing the timing. And TR up smash as well. Another shared stock. Very small lead for Green Team here. Okay. Much uh, <laughs> bigger lead now. <laughs> <laughs> Very small lead was exactly the way yeah. that, that, that could have possibly I gone. I didn't exaggerate. <laughs> Oh, Tetra card. Oh, no, the back, back air. air. Now we're forced into a 1v1. Can Don pull this off? I think so. It, if he could continue to get frame traps like so. He's getting the damage racked on. Oh, he's trying to look for the reset so he could go for a jump. Maybe look for a fair afterwards. Phantom has not been able to play. Oh, he gets, goes for forward air instead of a down air. This might cost him. He's going to take a decent amount of damage because of it. I get it. Like, look at the chain. Just one mistake. See how quick, like, one mistake in this game could lead to so much damage. Don, Don is just slowly losing this lead after having so much Phantom. This yeah. ledge trap has been perfect. He's a little shook. Once, uh, once kind of gets some good pressure going, he does not let it end. Mm -hmm. That's the problem. That's the thing. Like, even though Mario gets so much, oh, Ooh, good that, air. that nair was so needed. The down air not going to close that out. Either he's oh, going to get the air dodge with the forward base. smash. There we go. Like I said, Don able to finally close it out, just kind of empty hopping at him to force the air dodge. Because if he missed that, he probably would have been forced back off on an F2. And we saw how badly that ledge trap was going for him beforehand. Yeah. So good for him, able to close it out. Yo, light's Millie Rock, and I don't really know what's going on. Uh, you, yeah. Oh my goodness. 
I expected nothing else. <laughs> I, I, have, I don't have words. I don't have words. You know, it, it's the next generation, man, coming in. Go we got a lot of people mountain, here. You cowards. Go to a stage with Megalovania. That too. Man, they're really thinking hard about this one, too. It seems like the... Wait. Oh. See, Why uh, even bother looking at this? No good songs. You're not going to find anything you want, dude. Sorry, bud. You see, you think that, but Light is like a phenom at knowing quite literally every song. Yeah. Amongst some other people. Uh, actually, uh, Phantom, too. Uh, they, they only pick songs they like. But actually, can they even hear it right now? I mean, there's headsets. Ling oh, yeah. Actually, Ling, Ling, Ling can hear it. Yeah, no, there's a, uh, there's a, there's a live band this playing. This kid the, is uh, having the time of his... No, that, that no, didn't, don't, do, turn on. don't do that. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> He's T-posing behind Dine Don right now. Right. I was about to say, this kid's Sorry. having the time of his life, and he Light. was about to get himself banned from Light. stream. <laughs> Light just quite literally walked up to Ling Ling and grabbed. You know, that's... Not even ran, he walked. That, that That's an easy way to throw people the hell off. Like, yeah. you're like, all right, so... Is he going to attack? Is he going to jump? No, no. He just straight up walked to me and grabbed. That's a, a lot of confidence to do that, too. Ling taking a decent amount of damage at the start. But so is Light. That was actually a smart uh, idea from Phantom. But, you know, Light not pulling the trigger a little bit too early. Trying to go for the cancel. Bait out of Rebel's Guard. We got our send anyways. Good play from Light. Actually coming and saving Don. Have to. Like, it Broke up that down air attempt. Like, like I said before, a big part of this team right now for like red team focus is when Don is really solid at being a stock tank, it's one thing. But light losing his stocks early, that's huge. Uh, but what I was saying before is if you could double team on Don, prevent him from getting some momentum, then you'll be in a good position. That even though both the uh, the point players regularly uh, down one stock. Meanwhile, Phantom getting juggled over on the left-hand side. You see Don putting himself up as like a meat shield in between the two. It just forcing Ling to try and choose the right route. He chose wrong, but able to get in there finally. Good stall with the cape, avoiding any like uh, nares. That up smash from Ling I shoot in the back here was so good. Yeah, it's, and you know what? It was a big part of that was just because Phantom placed himself right at roll range. As soon as he did, it's like, all right, now Don has to commit to something that might be a little bit unsafe. And good timing from uh, Ling to get it. Oh, that might be it. All right. I'm not too sure about why he would go off stage with him, too. But, oh, you know, actually, to get an up air if he free fell. Never mind. All right, so Don going down there to try and cover what was almost an accidental SD from Light. But both of them get back anyways. Gets the anti-air up air. Gets Arsene online. But Don going to reverse the edge guard from Ling, waiting for him on the other side. She makes it through those downwards guns. Probably she didn't get hit by it. I imagine it interrupt the uh, Fox side view, right? Joker's gun. Yeah, it should it should be able to trade with the illusion. Uh, is, my, is my voice kind of low? Is that what's yeah, it, I actually pointed it out earlier. All right, that should be a little bit better for you guys. Yeah, it sounds a little bit better on my end. So, right. Okay, so. All right, we got to catch these things early so we can actually hear people. I am just naturally loud because I, I don't know how to stop talking. But I'm right. not Hispanic, sorry, dude. We talk at, we, you know, we have a very fast rate of oh, pace, man. Back here. Actually, that was four there. Should be a free edge guard. Oh, wow. Okay. And because of that, he's taking so much damage. Oh, Ooh, that it's was, a reversal. That was, that was risk. That was huge for Ling to be able to get something. But Ling forced the air dodge. That air dodge lasts so long. Even if, if you whip, you can usually punish after. The last lingering hit him down there, though, could actually lead to the back air. After, after waiting for years for Ling to finally come home to go for the up smash, he still parries him when he knocks on the door anyways and gets the up smash. Ling sitting at 122%, a pretty bad spot here. He just casually walks the other ledge. All right. I was, I was actually waiting for that. I was like, wait. Grabbed him. He's at no percent. Hit him. So yeah, I think that that's a big part of why um, they don't play with headsets is so they can make sure to communicate and yeah, stuff like that. Like, that's, hey, that's a big factor in doubles. That matters. Like that, that's whiff calls, and you see Ling and Phantom right away trying to figure out what happened. Like, all right, we did pretty good that the game, but we were 
kind of getting like caught in a few spots. This game, it seems like our positioning was a little bit too far away from each other. What right. are we going to do? I think a big part of that was just the fact that even though Don was still getting 2v1, Light punished them over and over and over for trying to cover him on it. Instead of being able to keep them separated, Light was forcing them to pay for the fact they were trying to the 2v1 on him. Speaking of TOs that we uh, have given all the praises, all the TOs here, shout out to TMPR, Ed, the, the head TO of Shine. Uh, we'll be the TO of Battle for the East, actually, next week as well. Ooh, really? Okay. Mm -hmm. Reminder that the highest placing non-PGR ranked member today has the opportunity to go to Retro... I mean, excuse me, to uh, Battle for the East for free. I did not know that. That's I awesome. I've said that so much, but people keep forgetting. I'll remind people later on, but also, we are in a game number four here. Light and Don taking a, a lead up here. What do you think Green uh, Red Team needs to do to adjust around what happened to them in the last two games? I don't know. It's, I feel like they just keep getting caught out by, uh, like, I feel like, just like Don and Light are kind of working together. Mm -hmm. They're, like, applying pressure, like, in tandem with each other. Yeah. Whereas sometimes Red Team feels like they're a little bit too separated. Yeah, it's so important to, uh, I thought Light was going to get caught by one of those uh, platforms, to be honest, after that back air. The thing we did not notice is the uh, casual switch to Daisy from Ling. That is true. You know, <laughs> actually, I, I noticed it, but I forgot to, to, to point it out. Ling plays Paisy. It really doesn't matter. I mean, at this point, the only confirmed difference is like the very, very, very minor slut difference in height, right? Uh, yeah, it's, it's something to do with the stance animation. Before, it used to be differences in actual turnips, but... Yeah, they're like, oh, that was an accident. Fixed. And everyone's like, wait, no. Yeah, where's Ling going? Oh, back and forth. Yeah, Ling just trying to stall out on the bottom. Meanwhile, that just gives him the opportunity to go try and double up on Phantom. A Phantom able to get through. Still holding a stock down. Don, the only one with a stock loss at the moment. Right, Phantom finally losing his stock, but so is Light. Ling Ling doing a good job of just trying to play that defensive play. Actually getting forced back off stage by his own teammate. And here we go. I like. See, this is what you talked about before. They're working in unison. So, mm -hmm. all right, whenever we got... Even though Ling's at kill percent, let's go double up on Phantom. There's no purpose to going to, like, focus on Ling, because eventually we'll close it out with the Nair to up smash. Yeah, it's like when they get someone off, when Richard gets someone off stage, they'll try to focus on ledge trapping. Whereas Green Team's kind of focusing more on, all right, I got Ling off stage. We're going to continue up on Phantom right now and vice yeah. versa. Yeah, it's and working even a little so, better for them. Like, even so, Red Team definitely thrives a lot more off stage by comparison to two to get the edge guards. You, you have to know where your strength will, will lie. And occasionally, we hate I love you, Dr. Shox. But anyways, so gets the parry. Trying to force him back off stage. Meanwhile, Light just trying to go for a back here. He followed, he followed him all the way off stage. And does the down smash, so luckily for uh, Phantom, didn't let go early. That up smash range is just not okay. Oh, and he actually gets saved because Don volleys him back in, so Link gets an extra lease on life. There we go, Phantom going to close out the stock. So is in Don losing his two. Light the only one with a uh, two stock up lead right now, but 97% as Light, I mean, as, as Fox. Kind of borrow time. Like trying to, to read the jump off stage. Meanwhile, Don gets set right into that fair. A little bit more damage on. Don has to play defensively. He does not want to lose one of these early stocks and force Light into a situation where he has to hold on to a stock at 100+. plus. Ooh, what a kind of neutral happening. Nothing, uh... Not much pressure going on right now, honestly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think everybody's just trying to avoid that one mistake of a whip, especially Light. Oh, this could cost him, though. He rapid jabbed on shield, and you already knew that, like, all right, there's no point in not going for an up smash right here. Ling hovered right above him, so that way Don couldn't jump in to try and punish him. And Don's going to lose his stock right yeah. away, too. Luckily, Light's sitting on a fresh stock, went 3%. Both of them very, very close to kill percent. Exactly. I guess, you, I guess they're pulling this off. Yeah, that's the big thing going for, uh, for Light one. right now. There it is. Gets the near to up smash. All right, Phantom is the only thing left between oh, them and Loser's Bracket. Oh, Ooh. actually gets hit the other way, so yep. Phantom able to live just a little bit longer. Light trying to look for a spot dodge or something out there. He had the jump read, but it's, there's afterwards again. Now Phantom has Arsene online. Yeah, this is peak Fox gameplay. You're seeing a oh, couple percent. We're going to fish for Nair and down air. Mm -hmm. thing is that, oh, there's the smash. Yep, yep. Good read. Yeah, trying to see if maybe if he was going to tech, uh, like go in towards the right hand side. Committed to the dash attack, got to cost him. And uh, even though that was a 3 1, 
it was still extremely close. Yeah, that was down to the wire every yeah. single game. Play able to make that 2v1 comeback. Really the first one that we've seen uh, amongst people who've played so well in the 2v1 all day and able to close it out. Because it, we've seen quite a few times where people are almost at it, but they just, just missed by this much. Mm -hmm. Not like that time, though. Going to be sitting comfortably in winter side of Grand Finals as we sit here comfortably in these chairs watching Retro Rumble 2019. L listening to this live band. Yeah. Just one section over. Yeah. What a great position to have 